so you can't even say thank you after eating. But auntie, I told you thank you now. Is that how they say thank you? How now? Tell me thank you properly. Are you sure? Which one is are you sure? Thank me properly, Jerry. Okay, auntie, don't vex you. Auntie, thank you for the rice. You are welcome. Thank you for the water that I drank. It's okay. Thank you for the stew. Huh? Thank you for the small piece of meat on top of the stew. What? Thank you for the cup that you put the water. Thank you for the plate that you used to put the food. Uh-uh. Thank you for the spoon that I used to eat. And also for the spoon that you used to cook the food. Thank you for the pot that you used to cook the food. Thank you for the pepper and maggie that is inside the food. Thank you for the water that you used to cook the food. Oh, wait, but what is it? Ah, Auntie, I'm still thanking you properly now. You are interrupting my flow. Auntie, thank you for the chair that I sat to eat the food. Thank you also for the clothes that you wear to cook the food. And thank you for allowing me to wear clothes and eat the food. Hey! Thank you for the gas that you used to cook the food. Ha! Thank you for the man that filled the gas that you used to cook the food. Thank you for the person that rented the shop to the man that filled the gas that you used to cook the food. Hey? Thank you for the man that rented the house to the man that rented the shop to the man that filled the gas that you used to cook the food. Thank you for the father of the man that rented the house to the man that rented the shop to the man that filled the gas for you to cook the food. Thank you for the mother of the man that rented the house to the man that rented the shop to the man that filled the gas for you to use to cook the food. <laughs> Hello, this is Microsoft Nigeria. What is your name and how can I be of assistance to you? Mm -hmm. Good morning. My computer is giving me problem. Oh. Good morning, sir. Sorry, what is your name? My name is Owori Takpamo Kinabapujuvi. That is quite a long name. What happened to your computer, sir? Yeah, I don't know. My uncle installed a game for me yesterday. When I woke up this morning, I cannot see the game again. What is the name of the game, please? How am I supposed to know? See, I told you that I can't see it on my laptop again. Okay, sir. Are you with your laptop now? Yes, it is here with me. That's perfect. Now, you're going to do exactly as I tell you, okay? Okay. If you take a look at the left bottom corner of your desktop, can you see that? What happened to the left bottom of my desktop? I am talking about my laptop and you are talking about desktop. Did the game run away from the computer and hide under the table? I don't mean a physical desk, sir. I mean the desktop of your computer. You are still saying it. I am talking about laptop. I mean laptop computer. I was playing game inside my computer yesterday. I am not talking about table tennis. How does it concern my desktop? Listen to me, sir. The screen on your computer is called a desktop. Oh, that is what you mean. Yes. Ah, my computer is not a desktop. It is my uncle's own that is desktop computer. My own is laptop. Yes, it's the same thing. Which one is the same thing? Say you, they did not train you before they employ you to work. With all due respect, sir, I know what I am talking about. The screen on your computer is called desktop. Okay, professor. I have heard you. So what did you say I should do with my tabletop? No. Desktop. Okay. Desktop. Correct. If you take a look at the bottom left, you will see a window sign. Can you see it? Hello? Hello, sir. Are you there? Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Which kind of person is this one? Hello? From desktop to the left corner of the window. So my game escaped through the window, Abby? No, I don't mean the window in your house. Okay. The window in your own house, Abby? The operating system on your laptop is called Windows. It is not even one window again. It is Windows. The windows are now plenty. Hello? So you say Windows, Abby? Yes, sir. How many windows are we talking about here? Not again. Sir, I mean the operating system on your laptop is called Windows Operating System. Mrs. Microsoft, what happened to the game in my computer? You people stole it, Abby. No, it's there in your computer. I want to direct you on how to get it out. I don't want to get it out. I want to play it inside my computer now. Nah. Uh-uh. Cheese. It is not only cheese. It is cheese balls. <laughs> is this 
now. See how you made me spoil my book. <laughs> <laughs> so you are scared, Abby? What kind of question is that? Oh. Okay. Mm hmm. Ayana. In today's special report, someone else is here. <laughs> It's very sweet too. Chai! What? <laughs> it's so Uncle Auntie Betty said I should tell you that she needs money to buy her. What do you mean by her? Was she without her before? He said I should ask you whether you don't have head before, or is it coconut that you used to see? Your uncle actually said that. Anyways, it's not his fault. I'm the one that needs money. Go and tell him I want to buy hair, like a wig. She said she want to buy human hair. That one that they call bone straight hair. Uncle, this auntie will suck you dry. Please try and give me my school fee. Let me hold it before she... Will, will you shut up? All the same. Go and tell her I don't have any money yet. Auntie, uncle said he does not have any money. For real? She said I should ask you that what did you do with the salary that you just received yesterday? Go and tell her that when I have money. <laughs> said I should tell you that he will see what he can do. Eh uh -huh. So he has joined the Stingy Men Association of Nigeria, right? Ah, auntie, that one is necessary. Even me, I got my ID card last week, Seth. Dangote, Don Jazzy, Ote Dola, Donald Trump, all of them are all our members, Seth. Me, I am moving the Apiaru. Come on, shut up your mouth, yeah. Don't worry, I will dump him and go for guys that are in Lavish Boys Association. Auntie, forget that thing, you know. Those ones that just borrowed small money, it will soon finish itself. Don't worry, me too, I'm going to join Swan. Ah, auntie, you want to become a bird? Ha, huh, dummy like you. Which one is a dummy? Swan is that bird that used to stay on top of water now, and it looks like dog fowl. Swan simply means Stingy Women Association of Nigeria, and our motto is, do not open. Ah, auntie, that one is good though. 
That way my uncle will be spending less money on abortion. The way people are passing on this our street these days, eh? It's like me, I will mount roadblock here and collect money for checking point too. Hey, that is a good business idea. Oh. I will discuss it with my uncle. That one that likes money more than his left eye. I know he will overtake the matter from himself. See the way this one is working as if he's the one that owns the road. Someone that doesn't pay tax. Oh. How can a jobless person pay tax? All that they know how to do is to smoke a bow and argue about football. Who is calling me? Me, I don't have money to borrow anybody. Oh. Hello? Hello, Taku. Who is this? This is Auntie Patience. Eh? Taku, Who? it's me, Auntie Patience. Auntie Patience? Yes. Auntie Patience, how are you now? Is your uncle at home? My uncle? Yes. Ah, Auntie Patience, you have to be patient too. Let me find out if he's around. Okay. See, 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 see. This kind of car is not supposed to be passing on this road at all. Can you imagine? Who even give him rude word in self? These are the kind of people that we are supposed to be making money from. That one now will pay 10,000 naira before he will pass. Hey! Hello? You didn't reply me now. Ah, anti person, sorry, Jari. Yoruba people will say Pele. Igbo people will say Ndo. Igala people Please, will say... Please, will you answer me and stop wasting my credits? Ah, you are owing the bank credit. Oh, eh uh -huh. What did you say you want again, Dede? Jesus. Ah, Jesus is in heaven now. Oh, Itako, are you okay? Okay, so click a close. Oh, Itako, is your uncle at home? Oh, I remember now. Do you want to come here? Please, can you answer my question for God's sake? Yes, yeah, so is that home? We are even planning to mount roadblock business, F. To do checking point, you know that kind Send of... Send me the address to the house, please. Ah, uh, forgotten. Ah, you want to come here? I oh, yeah, be coming. I will direct you on the phone. Okay. Oh. Uh -huh. Just come straight as if you are coming to the runabout. Do as if you are coming to the runabout now. Uh -huh. Then, turn at that place where there is a blue building. Are you there? Uh -huh. Immediately you turn like this, you will see one electric pole. Then go back to the express and use the runabout. What is the meaning of this now? She has said you should do as if you are coming to the runabout now. Yes, do as if you are coming there. I don't understand. If you don't understand, you overstand. Become in Jari. <coughs> oh, Ritak, but what kind of description is do as you are coming to the runabout? Oh yeah, if you can't do as if you are coming there, just come to the runabout at once. Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Auntie Shea, you know that your name is Patience. So we have to treat every of your matter with patience. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.